and tens of thousands of additional coronavirus vaccines are now headed to the Houston area. How many are going to uh, go to our health department in just a moment? But first, we are getting a look at who the state is prioritizing in this new allotment. KPRC 2's Michael Lapardi live in A Leaf tonight to explain. Michael? Dominique, the state is asking providers to focus on people who are 75 years and older, and that's why some of the doses are headed to clinics like this one that work with seniors. With thousands of doses of COVID-19 vaccines set to be distributed across Texas next week, the state is asking providers to put an emphasis on older people. The risk really increases with age, and so, uh, you know, we just want to really focus on that older adult population. Uh, you know, 75 and older, in, in addition to the other priority groups. Chris Van Dusen is a spokesman for the Department of State Health Services. It doesn't really change the eligibility, but it is, you know, uh, th this is a, I guess, a priority among the priority groups. He says about one in four Texans ages 80 plus have received the vaccine so far. WellMed hopes to help boost the numbers. The East Aleaf Clinic focuses on seniors and is set to receive 400 doses next week. We uh, do have a list and we sought the patients according to their age, and uh, our staff is calling uh, the patients, reaching out to their family members, and just informing them of when we get the doses. Medical Director Manasi Keekin says there's a reason for focusing on older patients. That is the population that really needs the vaccine. They are very high risk. But she also says her clinics and others will need more doses to get the job done. The Houston Health Department also plans to prioritize people at higher risk next week. About two-thirds of the doses it receives will go to the Area Agency on Aging, which works with seniors. We're live tonight, Michael Lopardi, KPRC 2 News.